Hello you guys, today me and my wife will go to a really cool shopping mall in Beijing. Um, she wants to buy some clothes for our trip to Japan. I would also like to check out some stuff there, maybe have a nice coffee. And uh, we want to make a video about that today and uh, so I hope you guys have fun. So babe, what's the shopping mall we're going to go today? I don't know, it's called Solana, I don't know. And what's the amazing thing about Solana? I mean, it has indoor space and also some open air space, something like that. So do you think it's the most pretty shopping mall in Beijing? Yes, of course, that's why we bring everyone there. Who is everyone? Your audience. <laughs> oh yeah, I got it. Okay, so we arrive, huh? Yes. <laughs> At Solana, it's actually cool. Yeah, I told you Solana. So cool. Solana, you I don't know. Wow. So many people, man. So many people. Yeah, people love to take pictures here, right? Ah, there's a Starbucks and pa pa Paris, Paris, Paris Baguette or something. And a really cool thing, and this is the main entrance, I guess. But it's quite old now. The first time we were here, it's quite new, right? Yeah, I think the first time when I was here, I was really impressed of the whole place, right? Yeah, but right now, as you can see, it's quite old. Yeah. I think Massimo Ducci and uh, Sarah belong together, right? Yes, I th uh, at least I heard that Massimo Ducci is maybe the... It's what? It's a... Uh, it's a luxury family. brand. Yeah, of course. So what do you think? I should buy these trousers? You buy that one, you buy one similar. But I like it, it looks so cool. Yeah, try it. <laughs> okay. So, but first I would like to have coffee. How would you like to go to this German restaurant to buy to have coffee and a piece of German cake? Is it in here? It's uh, 300 meters away from here. Remember, it's in that street and of course from that street it's the Sonata. So we have to go out here again? Yeah, if you want to. You want to stay in here? Checking out stuff, huh? So how you call this app? Yeah, this app you should do. If you ever go to China, you, you definitely have to have this kind of app because it helps you out. Babe, there is nothing. That looks great. It's the Hwasan village. You want to go there? No. Can we just grab a coffee somewhere? <laughs> then why not walk to the German bakery? Then you can try a piece of their German cake. 
Okay, so now we're on the way to the Lucky Street. It's called Lucky Street. And it looks kind of cool, I would say. I don't know what's... The... Is it German beauty style? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah. I don't know what kind of style it is. but. And on the other side, what is the egg there? This building, babe. Do you know that? Okay, there is a cool, another cool building. It looks like an egg or something. Right here. Yeah. Canadian International School of Beijing. Okay, Check can the Canadian International School of Beijing. Don't know what that is. And here is the Lucky Street. And these days there are a lot of Chinese flags out because people love their country and show it off, right? That's amazing. That's called South Carmen Bakery. Bodensee Kitchen. Oh, South German Bakery. Oh, okay. Let's check it out. I don't know, it looks so nice, right? Because I watched the movie last night and it's all about pie. I think I want that thing. Which? Raspberry yogurt cream slice. That's the last one I would eat. Then I would like to have the apple whole wheat cake. Delicious. 